So you might be trying to figure out how you can convert units and currency inside of your stock iPhone calculator application. So this is something that's really cool because you don't have to go through and download a different app or do anything else while you can do it straight from your new iOS 18 calculator app. So keep that in mind, you have to be on iOS 18 or newer in order to do this. So please keep that in mind. Now what you want to do is you want to make your way over into your calculator application of your iPhone. Then when you do that, what you want to do is you want to click on the bottom left corner right here, which basically shows you this little page right here. It's a little calculator icon. And then when you see that, you want to click on this convert button that's at the very bottom. So tap on to convert. And then what it's going to do is it's going to bring you into this page. Now you can start converting your units and measurements and all this stuff. So if you wanted to, you can convert 55 US dollars into, you know, euros if you want to, but you can tap on these down marks right there to bring up into this page. So here you can go and choose all these different types of currencies that you want. So if I wanted to rather change it to a New Zealand dollar, I can tap into here and I can convert 55 US dollars into, you know, New Zealand dollars or whatever else. You can also swap these back and forth. Let's say you wanted to change the numbers. You can swap them in between like this. You can also tap on here, but you can also change it to a different thing. If you want to change it to a data, like a data type, you can change a kilobyte into a megabyte and so many other things like a terabyte, all these different options, energy, length, you can change it from like, I'm sure inches to dollars, to not dollars, inches to like centimeters, all these other things. So you have this type of capability here too. So you can choose whatever you want to. But that's basically how you do it. The stock calculator application has so much more capability now and it genuinely is super, super cool. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.